We rocking? Rocking and rolling? Mm, mm hmm. Yep. We're rocking. I remember rolling. Just eating my oatmeal, you know? That's how it goes. What's up, YouTube? Finley King, back here with another video. Uh, today, I'm just going to tell you why you're being really lazy. I mean, I'm being lazy too. I get it. It's really easy to indulge in all the things that are really easy right now. Uh, it's easy to indulge in things that are easy. Yeah. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> um, it's just really easy to indulge in social media and all these external forms of entertainment and escapism right now. And I think that it's been creating a lot of uh, tension in people because it's, you know, voiding them of purpose. I just got on Instagram like 15 minutes ago and I'm like, what am I doing on Instagram? I'm just mindlessly scrolling through this. I'm like, you know, I'm interested to see what my friends are up to and stuff, but sometimes I literally will just go through every single person's story and I don't even watch it like really super intently. I just kind of like to get through it. And then I move on to, you know, a different social media app and get through that. And it just seems like when you spend all this time just getting through rather than doing something that's going to like further move your life ahead, you know, it's going to move your life ahead, then you're really just wasting your time. And I kind of had the same dilemma last night. And then I started working on this musical project and I started to just feel way, way better. And it turned into like a really, really cool project. I'm actually, I'm still working on it right now. It's, it's live right there. Um, speaking of music, you guys should go check out my music page. I just dropped a new music video for my song, Stuck in the Rain. Um, I'll link it below. I don't really post any of my music stuff here anymore, but you guys should go check out that page. And uh, yeah, check out the new music video that I put up there. It's pretty sweet. My friend Kote and Theo both helped me with it, which was super cool of them. But anyway, do stuff that is not just consumption and uh, God, man, it just, it makes the biggest difference in my life when I create something or I plan something and I, I set like even just the smallest goal to just like go on a walk, you know, put it into your calendar, five o'clock, go for a walk with, you know, a friend or by yourself or whatever, because time is just gonna, it is gonna pass you by so fast, so fast. I'm just like, I'm getting to the end of school and I'm just realizing how much of, excuse my language here, but how much of a bitch time is. It's just, it sucks, man. It just goes by so quickly. And I, sometimes I don't take these moments to reflect on how fast time is moving and how much time I'm spending doing the things that I'm doing in the moment that I'm doing them. And I just, I just do what's comfortable. I do what feels good in the moment. And I mean, when you put it into perspective of your entire life, when you look back on your life, you know, what are you going to be the most proud of that you did the most just completely stoked on, you know, that you did, are you going to look back and just be like, man, I wasted years of my life on on Instagram, you know, scrolling through other people's f photos. And like I said, it's using social media and even just other forms of escapism, you know, Netflix, Instagram, Facebook, whatever it is, you know, that you're TikTok, <laughs> you know, whatever it is that you're using to escape your life, realize how much time you're spending in that escaped version of your world. And when you come back, the real world is still there and you haven't put any work into it and you haven't progressed and you haven't grew at all. And if you're not growing, you're not changing, you're not learning, you're just going to stay in the exact same point in your life until you die. And then you will die being the person that you were when you were 20 years old, 21 years old, scrolling through TikTok. And this isn't like a bash on people that use these platforms or anything. Like I'm not trying to shame you or anything. It's just the amount of time that we spend doing the things that we do. It's just, it's a make or break. <laughs> it's a make or break for the life that you want. And, and I know that people are like, what else would I be doing right now? You know, what else do I do? 
read a book. <laughs> Honestly, like educating yourself in some form, even if you just want to watch like educational YouTube videos or a documentary, like learning content that's going to benefit you. And I know that maybe if you're a film major and you're watching, you know, Netflix films for educational purposes, great. You know, if you can actively listen to something, that's awesome. But I just think that there's a pretty distinct line between an educational consumption and a mindless consumption of content. And you know it when you do it. You know when you're consuming content and you're like, this is this is for this purpose. If you can ask yourself why you're doing it. I made a video about this, I don't know how far back, about <laughs> being quote unquote wise and like asking yourself why you're doing all the things that you're doing. It can be really helpful. Obviously it's kind of strenuous to <laughs> ask yourself these questions, but yeah, that's pretty much it. This is just a, a rant and catch up video. I just, I've been in a huge lull lately trying to, trying to get myself back on track and like figure out what it is I'm doing. And I've realized that one of the hardest parts of knowing what you're doing, you can't really do that unless you take the time to do that and you take the time to think about it and you take the time to do things that are not just mindless, mindless consumption of media. The internet sucks. It really sucks. Honestly, I hate the internet. I, I hate it so much. I, I love making videos and connecting with people and connecting with you guys, but like, it's just, it's just hard. It's hard to cruise through the internet and not have it feel like a large portion of what you consume is just wasting your life. And <laughs> I don't know why I think that, you know, you watching my videos is any better than consuming any other content. You know, maybe it's just like a wake up call and you watching this now seven minute video is going to in the long run possibly influence you to decrease the amount of things that you consume or monitor them at least. <laughs> yeah, something like that, right? It's a sunny day today in Corvallis. It's quite nice. It's quite nice today. Quite nice. <laughs> I think I might go outside after I finish this song. Maybe I'll finish it. Maybe I won't. I'm lettering the drums right now and they they sound pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. You guys wanna sneak peek? You wanna sneak peek? Okay, okay, okay. Check this out. Check this out. This is this is fire. Uh, <laughs> this is fire, bro. Okay, I don't even know if you're gonna be able to hear this, but this is like the breakdown when it hits the when it hits the 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 chorus. <laughs> There's no vocals yet, so just okay. There's no vocals. I don't know if you guys can hear that. All right, the breakdown is right here. All right, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. I'll uh, see you guys, I don't know, just soon. Hey, 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 hey.